Hello, everybody. It's the day after the day I said I was going to make what remains of Ed Finch. And honestly, I didn't think I was going to make the video, but for some reason, I have this big urge to, to do it. Let him go. Just let him go. Let him go. Hey, give it back. And I just wanted to continue the video again. I'm not even. I'm not even. <laughs> I'm not gonna speak about it. I'm just gonna get right to the point. Bad man. So no. The poor little guy was taken away from a pencil. Don't worry, he is fine. No hurt. No harm came to the baby. Anyway. So today it's just gonna be me playing Edith Finch, just like yesterday. We left off uh, where we found out that Walter has been underground for the past 30 years, and no one batted an eye. But if she never told me about an uncle under the house... Yeah, see? I can only imagine what else she was hiding. Hmm. I don't want to make the same mistakes she made. Same mistakes, huh? What kind of same mistakes? I'm gonna bury something that's still alive. Wait for it. It's loading. Give it time. Is it is it appearing for you coming up? Yes. Oh, it is. It's not appearing for me. Was left, or maybe two. Oh yeah, here we go. Alright, Maria, here I got it. Here, so you can hear it. Alright. Ready, Dyke? I thought it was time I heard the stories for myself. So what stories? I found out what happened to everyone else. What happened? But now I'm worried the stories themselves might be the problem. The stories? Okay, I'm just saying what she's saying. This isn't healthy for me. Maybe we believed so much in a family curse. We made it real. Oh my god. The place where he died. 1952 to 2005. The dude was 43? Wow. Damn. Poor guy. I wonder what that is. I'm just here to check. I'm just checking the video just to make sure everything's going all right. Okay. I don't know if I should even be writing this. Writing? Maybe it'd be better if all this just died with me. Oh, everything is destroyed. Oh. I was spoopy. But I thought you should know about your family. Well, I mean, you should. Isn't that the point? I must... I can't... Oh. And the history you're a part of. Yes. You should. Without any history, there's just no you. Wow. This game's dark. Though to be honest, I feel as lost as you probably do right now. Who are you talking to? I haven't asked that myself in the past two videos. I haven't... Like, who is she talking to? The people in these stories believed them. For what that's worth. Hmm. I wonder what the delay is on the video. I'm not gonna check now. I'm still sick from yesterday. <clears throat> and when you look at the house, that history of imagination and stubbornness and madness, wow. any of it seems possible. Oh yeah, I, have, I forget I can control what she does. I 
feel like I should go. Oh, it's what it's from. It's from the first episode when we were looking at the swing. Oh, there's the swing. Wow. That's sad. I think we've been surrounded by death for so long. We've just gotten used to it. How do you get used to death? What kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? Eh, good one. That is kind of sad, though. It's embarrassing for me to admit this, but. <laughs> but. The pet cemetery may be more uncomfortable than the human one. I'm gonna, just for the fun of it, I'm gonna read their names. Christopher. Shad. Oh, this one's a. F oh, and right on top, there's like the little hole that tells you what they were. Fish. This one's a fish. This one's a cat. Shadow. Three Oliver. Three were mine, and two had been my fault. Derpy, Derpy Jr., and Burpy. Uh, Christopher was a fish. Shadow was a cat. Uh, Oliver was a bunny. Shitesy looks like was a dog. Bob also a dog. Poor Bob. And this one has a name, Frog, but it won't show us what the name is. Maybe. Uh. What baby? You know what? You should. Zerpy, Lurpy. Furpy, Furpy, Chirpy, Charlie, Tucker, Daisy, Poco, Zoe. Jeez. Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. Oh my god. Molly Finch. Oh, and she dreamed of being a cat. Poor Molly. Calvin Finch, uh, the astronaut kid. Sven. We still don't have a picture of Sven. What the heck? And Eddie Finch. Who was Eddie? Oh, we didn't get to Eddie, the girl. Edie, it's Edie. It's pronounced Edie. Walter. Uh, yeah, we got to Walter. The one that got run over by a train. And Barbara Finch. Yeah, she's right there. Go. Cool. Alrighty, right. I'm sure Odin's monument had been Edie's idea. Yeah. My mom was always trying to move on, but for Edie, the past never went away. Looks like it. I wonder who this is. Really descriptive on the nose. Yeah. She could Let's see it poking out of the water at low tide. Low tide? Let's see what it is. Edie said she dreamed about the old house every night. Oh my god, it's the old house. You know how when we were looking through the little thingy, we found out that the house was supposed was drowned? We saw that it was drowned. What was it? What's up? A little house? The little house is, uh... It's a, it's a house that, that was, fell into the water, and it broke. Edie's side was always easier for me to understand. Edie's side was always easier for me to understand. Okay. But the older I get, the more I can see where my mom was coming from. Hmm. Gus? Where's Gus? Come here, leave him alone. I need you to be quiet. Her dad had been pretty strict, but it wasn't enough to save her brothers. She was just trying to do better. What about happened to the brothers? Sorry. Thirty-three. Sam. Gregory. Where's Gregory? Um, right there. Oh. Gregory is like the one in the middle, right above K, right next to Gus. I do not want to know. It was only she lost one. two of her brothers, just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Lois and Sanjay. And Milton. We never found Milton's body, so my mom insisted we were putting up a monument, not a tombstone. 
Milton? Milton? How did you not find his body? He wasn't. He wasn't in the swing on the on the swing, dude. There's so many things I wish I could ask my mom now. Part of me thinks this is what she wanted all along. For me to come back someday and find everything out for myself. You know. You know what would make the ending really sad for this? Is if Edith was the one that died in the end, finishing the curse. Looking back on it now, if she told me there was going to be so much climbing, I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. You were pregnant? Wow. That is... Where do I go from here? Oh. I never met Grandpa Sam, but I think he and my mom had a lot in common. Where are we? They were both pretty intense. I can see that. Hello, bear. Are you, are you gonna, gonna say hi back? No? Keep to attack. I don't like you either. All right. Oh, it's the dude that never put down the camera. <laughs> Whoa. Don, I promise you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Am I gonna have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Don. Shooting is strongly encouraged. Perfect. It's gonna rain the whole weekend, isn't it? I'll never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. <laughs> okay, got it. I'm gonna take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. What kind of pictures? Definitely what? should not have drunk all that coffee. Like this? All right. Hmm. <laughs> Is he taking a pee? Hold still while I take a picture of you. I definitely won't be moving. You... Hey! <laughs> That's a keeper. Take a picture of my grandpa taking a poo. I'm just saying, I'm not always gonna be here. Come here, keep him quiet. You need to remember this stuff if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was gonna be fine? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. What do I need to take pictures of? Last time I was with my brother Calvin. Man, that was a great trip. Don, don't you think you could find something more interesting to photograph? Taking pictures of my dad is interesting. Grandpa's fan taught us how to fish, how to build a fire. Oh. Dad. Good eyes, no. Don. Not now. Busy. And photo take. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of you. Take a shot? What are you talking about? Oh. Dad, I... Just breathe. I know. Turn off your imagination. Focus on your target. Let me get behind you. Do I have to do this? Don, you don't have to do anything. But if you want oh my to god. Survive, you need to be strong. No. Great shot, Don. <laughs> I'm proud of you, Don. Oh, I'm moving in. Remember that, okay? 
Okay. Oh. Dad, it, it's twitching. I think That's it's totally still... normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not to think about. Dad. Ooh. Wow, that was sad. Of all these stories, that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. That is sad. The volume's off. Here, go sit over there. All right, then. Ooh. Family has some problems. And a curse. Okay. Who's K? Oh, the leaf dude. Hmm. Instead of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out of his way to meet it. Don't we all? Can I get out of here now? No? Okay. Um, how do I get out of here? Uh, guess he was friendly. Maybe. Sam spent his life shooting photos, but Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. Eventually, move the door and call through there. Ooh. Ooh. What's up? I don't know. I don't. I don't. After Sam died, my mom and Edie got really close. They'd both lost a lot. Lost? You mean like people or things? Oh, it's Quigley. Who is that? Oh, it's the... It's the... year old that I saw. Gregory. Where's Gregory? Okay, he's right in the middle. He's right below Edith and to the right of Gus. Gregory. Uh, 1976 through 1977. He was one year old. Damn. Divorce contract. Wow. Orcas Island? Do you remember the way Gregory used to... Don't let the volume get too close. ...thought he was alone? Like, something funny was happening, but only he could see it. Only he could see it? I think he saw things the rest of us don't. Oh, my mind feels so relaxed. Oh, I'm controlling the frog. Right trigger. Oh. Hand over, Gregory. It's time to. Hello. No, you always take out the baby before you. Oh my God. Sam, I told you I don't want to talk right now. Ducky. I wonder what he's. Ducky. 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 Wait. Everything so far was just death. Does that mean we're gonna see what I think we're gonna see? Don't let it get too close. Don't get too close. Don't get too close. Don't, don't let the noise get too close. Go sit over there. It sounds really terrible when that happens. Trust me. When am I done? After I'm done recording like an hour and 30 minutes of content. Frog. Rivet. 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 Wee! Oh my god. Wee! Wee! Oh my god. I think I saw a bar of soap I had to get. Whee! Doing! Get over here! Oh, John Cena. Well, it's not a bar of soap, it's actually soap. Doing! Oh, I broke the game. Oh, never mind.
No. Damn it. I'm still playing as the frog. Oh my god. My eye is so twitchy today. That is weird. But I know what happened wasn't your fault. Yeah. What is going on? Oh my god. I'm sure he's Oh no! Get away! No! Get away! Get away! No! Oh whatever, trigger. <laughs> What's up? Did you turn it off? It's okay. There. There. Wow, but that's a sad story. After all these years, Edith finally decides to come back just to see. Just to see. Put it down. Don't leave it there. A poem for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard, before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. This is trippy. My father made him come, of course, but Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. Hey, don't get close to the camera. Let me do this. Yes. We don't need a step on. Yes. Ruin. Yes. Yeah. When the time for photos came, Dad ordered him to come here, but Gus declined and there was a sign held up his middle finger. <laughs> wow, very mature. The wind picked up and panicked peace appeared and quickly went, but all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. Oh, they just disappeared. Oh my god. Rain came down in buckets that but no one seemed afraid that nature might destroy the tent our dad was completely made. I'm the conductor of winds. The thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. But all my father said to us was make the music louder. So what I'm foretelling so far is that it's not the family's fault that they keep dying. It's always someone else's choice that makes them end up messing up. Out there on the beach alone, it's just you, the wind, the sea, and foam. Oh. But I didn't until we found you. Nineteen sixty nine to nineteen eighty. They were going to name me Gus. Wow. How old is that? 
Sixty-nine to eighty-two. Uh, pff, overall, Maria, put the volume down. It's killing everyone's ears. Bring the phone. Yes, you can. All right. Now, with less ear rape, let's get through this. Do I need to climb this? If so, that'd be pretty cool. Oh, I do. Okay. The loft after her brother's side. Your mom was. At the time, it was as far away as she could get. India. Who is this now? Dawn? Oh, Dawn. 1968 to 2016. She made a good life. I think that makes her 46. 48, I don't know. Dawn's and Sanjay. She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Your dad's name was Sanjay? Yeah. Cool. Oh, look. The Holy Bible. Ooh, she's really the religious. Holy another thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. Oh, so your mom was... After all this time, your mom's name was Dawn? Couldn't you have started with that? <laughs> Camila. <laughs> Um, the window. My mom right. moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Lewis was born a year later. So she became a teacher just to go to India and teach English. I do not want to go to Los Angeles. That was dumb. All right. When my dad died, I don't think mom knew where else to go. Go back home. Take care of your kids. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. Milton. Lewis. Mint. Rye. St. Jim. Basil. Dawn. Only a little one. The house had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. Hmm. I didn't control it. Things were good. Almost normal. But Almost normal? Oh. Is there anything else I can interact with in here? Nope. I'm out of here. Ooh. The beginning of the end was Milton's 10th birthday, when Edie gave him a castle. Ooh, Milton. <gasps> After Milton disappeared, the only thing he left behind was a room full of paintings. Wow. Trippy. 1992. No, 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 don't go back into it. Uh, 1992. 2003. Wow. And by the looks of it, it didn't write down the death date. That means they didn't live in the house by the time he died. Yeah, the, see, the curse is not the house. It's something in the family. Go in. It's a pretty good painting. Even though I don't know this. What is this for? Ooh. See, I think he's okay. Is he okay? Hold the light. Magic paintbrush. Huh. This is Milton. Uh, extra, extra historic. Uh, histor I think that's a historic American newspaper now available. Hmm. 
Hey, keep it down. Milton Finch in the Magic Paintbrush. Cool. I was four when Milton disappeared. Oh. That's sad. At least you know you know know how your brother looks like. Can you guys keep it down? Samson. Mom spent months with my brother. Then she sealed the doors. I might have to end the video and then make a part three later on during the day when it's more silent. Should I do that? I can't get through out to the main door. What is this glue? No, it's flex glue. It's flex glue. They used flex glue, guys. Oh my god. Whatever I'm not getting through that. Mom didn't want it getting out. Hey, Milton, you're gonna have to get in there. Is that everything we needed to check out? Because if so, I'm going to have to end the video. He tripped. Again. Third time today. If not 50th. No, you, oh, you put it back up. Oh, there's an upstairs. Mom definitely recommended Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. Oh. Lewis. Uh, you haven't described who Lewis was yet. Oh, here we go. Top left. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room. Until Mom got him a job at the cannery. It's okay, but it's time to go. The cannery? Huh. Yay. How long has the video been going on? We're supposed to be checking... Oh my god. Lewis, 2010. So they did move out by 13. Everyone always told me to stay out of Lewis's room. Except Lewis. The first thing I looked when I got in here was legalize marijuana. <laughs> this dude got high. But after graduation, he just spent his entire time being high. He lives in a freaking boat. Boat house. You know what? Officially, I'm pretty sure that's all the time I'm going to have for now. I can continue this in a little bit, but not right now. Uh, if I already guess, I've only made it like, what, 30 minutes? Uh... Oh well, time for me to end the video. Hope you guys enjoy. Make sure you check out. Make sure you hit the notification bell, so then you know when new content or when a new video is out. So you can make sure you stick with me, and then you'll know where we're supposed to start off. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in about an hour. <laughs>